1914, Rochester's New York Central Station opened to the public. Designed by renowned architect Claude Bragdon, the station was in operation for a half century. In 1965, the historic station was tragically demolished and eventually a so-called temporary station was erected. For nearly 40 years, this deficient station served our region. For nearly a decade, Congresswoman Slaughter has been working to build a new, modern station that honors our past. In 2015, she kicked off construction efforts by counting down the demolition of the deficient station. Three, two, two one, where's the van A major milestone in building a new train station here in Rochester. Construction crews started demolishing the old station today. Congresswoman Louise Slaughter helped secure much of the funding. We got an inside look at the construction happening at the Rochester train station today. Congresswoman Louise Slaughter was on site to tour the station and provide an update on the progress there. The project marks the biggest boost yet to Slaughter's effort to improve rail travel to and from Rochester's downtown station. Congresswoman Louise Slaughter was in town with local officials to take a look at how construction is going. Congresswoman Louise Slaughter leading a team of local business leaders through the $34 million terminal project. All new rail, all new rail. She's trying to sell them on the commerce benefits. A huge, huge improvement for everybody. We can bring a lot of companies in, but if the transportation and the infrastructure is not good enough, they're not going to stay. Thank you, Louise, for the new train station. We can't wait to be able to visit friends and family by train. Thanks again, Louise, for all your hard work. So thank you, Louise. You have been a steadfast supporter of RIT and TID, both here in Rochester and in Washington, and you continue to make our community a better place. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, I'm Naomi Silver from the Rochester Red Wings, along with Spikes, here to say thank you to Congresswoman Slaughter for our beautiful new train station in Rochester. I'm William Clark, President and CEO of the Urban League of Rochester. For the past 20 years, the Urban League headquarters has been the cornerstone of the entrance to the northeast quadrant of Rochester. This train station has already had a tremendous economic impact on the residents of northeast Rochester. And I'm here today to say thank you, Louise. We are all aboard. On behalf of the University of Rochester's greater than 30,000 employees and greater than 11,000 students, many of whom are rail travelers, thank you, Louise, for our beautiful new train station. 